This season, Liverpool have looked to be powered by one of the Rolls-Royce engines made in Derby. The main components, Alan Hansen, ticking over smoothly at the back. Steve McMahon, the midfield motor. And the thrusting overdrive, supplied by Peter Beardsley. And John Barnes, who also directed traffic towards the Derby goal. We soon witnessed the famous Beardsley swagger. And the Barnes boogie. Liverpool threatened when Nickel put in McMahon, who skied his volley from eight yards. Beardsley squirmed past a few challenges to smack a 20-yarder just past the post, but chances were rare. In the 54th minute, the combined efforts of Barnes and Beardsley set up a scramble. Nichols' shot was cleared off the line by Callahan, but the busy Johnston was on hand to score from a narrow angle and give a display of the Liverpool break dance. Derby had few chances. McMinn tickled Grobelaar's ribs from 25 yards. And McMinn set up G, whose centre skidded in front of the onrushing Gregory. Liverpool thought they'd gained a penalty when Barnes tangled with Wright. Referee Tony Ward saw no offence. But negative tactics aren't the stuff of champions, and with 20 minutes to go, the Merseysiders started playing for time. And they got their comeuppance. Forsyth forsook his left back berth. He played the ball out to sub Gary Micklewhite and then gleefully smashed in the cross. Derby manager Arthur Cox came on as 12th man for the last few minutes. Barnes from Beardsley. And still Barnes, how did he get that across? Johnston. And, oh, off the line. Johnston, goal. Craig Johnston put it away. After the first shot from Steve Nicholl had been scrambled off the line. For Scythe. And again, good run by Michael for Scythe. Brilliant run. Mickle White's there. And a chance here for Scythe came in. And it's the equal.